continuous periodic law is arranged in the increasing order of atomic masses. Due to some difficulties, new periodic law was developed and this is called as modern periodic law. This law states that the physical and chemical properties of the elements are periodic functions of their atomic number. The physical and chemical properties of elements are periodic functions of their atomic number. means that elements are arranged in the increasing order of atomic numbers and the elements with similar properties will repeat after regular intervals. Okay, most commonly used periodic table is long form periodic table. Long form periodic table. Okay, now what is mean by periodicity? Periodicity. Periodicity means the periodical repetition of elements with similar properties after regular intervals when the elements are arranged in the increasing order of atomic number. Okay. This is called as periodicity. Okay. The periodical repetition of elements. Periodical repetition of elements with similar properties with similar properties after certain regular intervals. Okay. After certain regular intervals. When elements are arranged in the increasing order of atomic number. Okay. When elements are arranged in the increasing order of atomic number. Order of atomic number. Okay. So, this means atoms having similar properties will have same valence shell electronic configuration. Similar valence shell electronic configuration. Okay. Similar valence shell electronic configuration will have similar properties. Okay. Similar shell, valence shell electronic configuration. will have similar properties. Okay. So, elements with similar properties will repeat, will uh, re repeat after regular intervals. Okay. So, they are arranged according to their increasing order of atomic number. Okay. Next, let us explain long form periodic table. It is based on modern periodic law and the elements are arranged in the increasing order of atomic number. Okay. Now, the horizontal rows present in the table are called as periods and vertical columns are called as groups. Okay. There are seven periods starting with different principal quantum numbers n. Okay. Value of n is changing for different periods. Different principal quantum numbers. 
that is for first period the electrons are arranged at n is equal to 1 that is k shell electrons are present in k shell so first 1s orbital the electrons are present example hydrogen and helium okay then in this case of second period electrons are added at n is equal to 2 that is l shell and so on okay next in the case of periods the 6th and 7th 6th and 7th are lanthanides and actinides they are arranged at separately arranged at the bottom of the table next in the case of groups it contains 1 to 18 columns or groups okay and numbered from 1 to 18 okay and each group is having similar valence shell electronic configuration each group contains similar valence shell configuration this means that they are showing similar properties okay each group shows similar properties so each group is in ham have a is having uh, we can consider each group as a family okay each group is a family and they have similar properties okay Next, nomenclature of elements with atomic number greater than 100. Okay. So, in the long form periodic table, how can we name the elements according to the atomic number greater, whose atomic number is greater than 100? Okay. So, names are derived from the atomic number using numerical roots for 0 and 1 to 9. Okay. So, we are using numerical roots. And these roots are linked together. These roots are linked together in the order of digits. And at last we are adding IUM. Okay. Then let us take one example. 101. How can you write 101? 1 is un. So un. Then 0 is nil. N-I-L. Then again 1 is un. And last we are adding IUM. So this will be the name of 101. Okay. Later these elements were discovered and they got the name. So first element is un nil un yam. Okay. So how can we write 102? UN then 0 nil then 2 is by IUM. Okay. By Next, 103, union, nil, 3 is tri, so trium, okay, so like this we can write the name of different compounds by using the name, the, uh, for each digits we are using numerical roots and we linked these roots and at last we are adding IUM. Okay, later these elements got its official name after the discovery of new elements. Okay.